Good day, this is DIY Guy123, and unlike many of my videos, I'm not giving information, I'm asking for information. So I've got a bay liner with a 3 liter Merc Cruiser engine in it, and it's got one of these uh, quick drain systems where you pull the uh, bilge um, pipe out of the, the drain pipe out of the, uh, the bilge drain, and then pull the cap off it and drain your motor oil out, and it's a great way to keep uh, the bilge area clean. The problem is, you can see, it's just barely a trickle that comes out of there. And I don't know if that's normal. It's not a big hose. It's like a 3 8 hose. And, um, you know, I would just expect it to have drained faster than that. So, I'm just curious if anyone else has slow problems or if the slow uh, drains like this or if they fixed it somehow. I've tried blowing compressed air back up um, into the engine block just or into the oil pan to just try and kind of free up some blockage and um, you know expecting that in, if after I do that initially there would be a big surge of oil and maybe until that blockage got over the hole again um, there was no surge it didn't seem to change anything I've snaked it as far as I could with a coat hanger but of course it won't make the bend um, up into the oil pan so I can't snake it the entire way and uh, I've heard of people using like a snare wire to snake it that's more flexible. I have not done that. Um, I've even tried pressurizing, I want to be careful when I say this, uh, mildly pressurizing the, uh, the crankcase by keeping the oil fill plug on and pulling the dipstick out. And where the dipstick hole is, use compressed air in there. But when I talk compressed air, I'm talking like 15 to 20 psi. So not... <laughs> not 80 or 90 or 100 because i'm sure you'd hurt a seal or you might um i've also heard if you overpressurize it the pcv valve will let go so you won't hurt anything but anyway if you have any thoughts on this i would love to hear it